Hello guys! Yes, welcome to my new car. I'm very excited to share this with you because this is my first ever car. And so it is a 2021 Mercedes CLA 180. This is both my car and Will's car. We've split it. Our old car, or I should say Will's old car. I was insured on that it was his car. We used to drive a little Ford Fiesta. Love that car. I think she was from like 2004. So she's an old lady now, but she's lasted amazing. She's still going. Will's younger sister is about to take her driving test. So Will decided to give his old car, the little Ford to his sister. And we just wanted a bit of an upgrade. I also just wanted to own my own car. Being straight with you guys, I didn't know whether to film a video about this car because it's never my intention to brag and especially after the year we've had I didn't want it to come off as like insensitive materialistic or anything this channel is about like documenting bits of my life and this is a big part of my life buying my first ever car like my family never had a car growing up and never had one I am obviously very very grateful and I recognize that we're in this privileged position to be able to buy this car nonetheless I hope you guys are excited this video is just gonna be a bit of a vlog so I vlogged us picking up the car it's actually now like two three weeks later because we went to Ireland and I wanted to get to know the car before I filmed. Since it's very very different to little Ford it has a lot of features that I'm not used to. It is also an automatic and the Ford was a manual. I have a manual driving license but I had never driven an automatic before. So why we went for this car we were looking at either like an Audi or a Mercedes and after we did a bit of research I found some models specifically like the CLA line that I just fell in love with. This is a coupe and it's AMG line which I believe means it's like a bit sport here. Quick disclaimer, I really don't know much about cars. I just did my research on this car. <laughs> yeah, I love her. She's perfect for us. We like, we don't have kids. We have Mochi, who's obviously a really tiny dog, so we didn't need like a massive boot or anything. But anyway, it's just been really exciting. This car is so, so nice to drive. Gonna go ahead and start the vlog of like the day we got her. And then I'll come back to now, present day. I'll give you guys a little car tour. And I'm also actually gonna drive to B&M right now to pick up just some bits and bobs. So yeah, enjoy the mini vlog. Time has come. We are gonna go pick up the new car. I'm wearing my absolute favorite sweater at the moment. This is from a, a little brand called Kiwi and Co. And I have my absolute favorite jeans on from Motel Rocks. You guys have seen these before. Also, we're like experimenting with art in the background. Ignore it. phone to it which is so odd. Get back Shui, let's just get back and get some food. Adjust my seat. Put on the brake. Brake, and then I start. Oh, see the letters. Down is to drive. Yeah. Whoa! Oh my god, it's so smooth. <laughs> and then you do, yeah, just slow down. You literally just press on the brake. Yeah. <laughs> There's no clutch. Where's the clutch? <laughs> Whoa! My left foot was gonna go into the. Yeah, it's natural. Oh my god, that's so weird. Hi, welcome to this part of the video. So your girl's just arrived at B&M. The sun has come out, which makes me really happy. It was so rainy this morning. And I'm gonna pop in and get some bits for the car. I did try to film like a mini drive with me on the way here. Yeah, that's fine. But I don't have one of those like car mount tripod situation things and it just didn't work. So let's go to B&M and then we'll do a little car tour. I 
didn't get too much. Just starting off simple. It was just like an air freshener. This car definitely still has like the new car smell. So I'm going to enjoy that whilst it lasts. But I'll have this for when it runs out. I got some hand wipes. Another little air freshener. I got it because it's black. But the scent is black ice. Gloss dash wipes. Got this pretty basic, just like a cheap makeup bag essentially. We can use this to put all my random bits and bobs in. I'm gonna put it all together and then I'll show you guys when I do the tour. Okay, so this is what I see from the driver's seat. Starting on the door, we've got heated seats, really handy in winter. Locks, very easy. You just standard switches here. Windows, that's how you adjust your mirror there. And what I love about down here is that there's just so much room. You could put a like massive water bottle down there or even like a small bag. On the right of my steering wheel, I've just got like the controls for my lights, an air vent, and then here is the steering wheel. So yes, the interior is completely leather which I love. That was something we were after. It was something Will was particularly fussy about actually. And I've never had like controls on the wheels. So I'm actually just gonna turn on the car and then I can show you what some of these functions do. It's just a start button, which again, I'm not used to. And then the long display panel switches on. So yeah, starting at the wheel, you've got like your back button, basically controls like the screen there as far as I'm aware. You can use this little black part as a trackpad essentially. You can like flick through the men user. This controls volume and this controls calls and then you've got this side which controls this part of the screen. Again very new to me <laughs> that you've got drive neutral and then reverse. It's so so easy. I love that it's right there. Here we've got more air vents, a bunch of controls that I still have to play around with. The thing that I love about this car is, is that it has a like voice control system so if you say hey Mercedes how can I help? Turn on the air conditioning. You can do that, which is super useful for when you're driving. The air conditioning was already on, but I should have cleaned this before, but we went to the beach yesterday. And so that is what that is. In the below section, we've got my two pedals. This part of the car, I absolutely love this middle section. The first part is your wireless charging dock. Part of the car I was very excited to use. We've got a USB-C port there. We've got two cup holders here. I typically just put my keys in here and then I've got some hand gel. Here we've got a massive trackpad that again controls this very easily. This is also touchscreen. They've just made it very, very easy to use this. Another thing is that when you put this car into reverse, it has sensors so you can see where you're going. Obviously it starts beeping at you if you get too close to anything. So we've got volume control, etc, etc. Um, and then this bit is quite cool. Dynamic so you can change if I press that. You can change your like driving style. All this is, I believe, is just a little like hand rest. So very nice. And then here we've got the glove compartment. Let me tell you, I am in love with this. It's so nice to have. It has again two USB ports just there. In here, I just keep the things that I want to be able to grab easily. So I've got my USB-C cable, gum, yeah, very important puppy poo bags. Of course, just like a bunch of masks and some sunnies. So yeah, that's really nice. I love that bit. In this compartment, I've just kept handy bits and bobs, important bits, documents, the wipes I bought earlier, an ice scraper, and then here, a little emergency kit. Handy bits and bobs in there. So like tampons, I've got plasters, pen, uh, tissues, hand cream, paracetamol lip gloss and then I've also put my air fresheners in here and then the passenger seat has heated seats as well I've just plugged in my phone because it then activates carplay it means you can get some of your apps up and including like Spotify which is very very useful and something that's so nice about here is there are air vents for the back passengers and also a little charging dock in the back here I just have some camera bags mochis car seat i think we want to get a nicer one so if you have any recommendation dog car seats let me know and then we also have shopping bags okay my loves i think i'm gonna end the video here yeah will and i are more than happy with it there are a few things i want to add to the car like i have keychain coming soon 
from my friend's business which is super cute and then I also want to buy a car mount like a camera tripod so I can vlog in the car a bit more maybe do like a drive with me video I don't know yeah I'm just super super happy with it thank you guys for watching I hope this was somewhat enjoyable and yeah I'll see you in the next one stay safe be kind love you all bye